All right, Coach. Um, a solid match by the team um, all around, basically. Starting off with the first point, you just went with it and just, like, you never stopped. You just went on and uh, just kind of beat them at their own game, basically. Just talk about that. Yeah, I think our team came out really, really aggressive. Um, starting with Shalanda from the service line. Um, she went on several runs tonight. Um, she really went back there and, and took charge. And I'm really proud of how she went back there and, and gave our team opportunities to put that team out of system and let our block go to work. Um, we out blocked the best blocking team in our conference, which is definitely um, you know exciting for us because we've been working a lot on our block in practice. Um, and then you know our defense just went went to work as well because our blocking was so disciplined. You know our defense, you know Bailey leading the charge back there. I think she had 27 digs. Incredible performance all around. Block and D. I'm really really proud of the team. So speaking of defense, like you said, they were the, they came in leading the the in the conference and blocking. We led in defense, and our players were just flying around all over the place. Um, how? Without going into any specifics, how did you um, like stop their blocking or not hit into the blocking? I mean, without going into, like I said, specifics and your game plan. Like, was that just to stay away from one player, a certain player, or? No, we we really don't teach our players to avoid the block. We just avoid, or we just focus on staying high going high hands, not trying to challenge them low in those scenes, but staying high. And we have awesome athletes on our team that play the game at a high level and play high already. Um, so they really need to stay true to their game and not be afraid to challenge the block and not avoid anybody, just staying high through their hands and, and work their shots so that the block stays disciplined and um, we can work around it a little bit too. I'm not sure that they ever took a lead in the match. Have to go back and look, but it seemed like when you needed a point, you went to McKenzie more. Mm -hmm. Twelve kills, let let everybody with twelve kills and, and a double double with ten digs. Talk about her her performance. Yeah, Kenzie came out just really really consistent. Um, she, it's the stuff that maybe non volley people non volleyball people would would know, but. She just commands the court and her presence on the court, even in the back row. She does a really good job staying calm through those chaotic plays, and it just makes everybody else around her really calm. But then on top of that, she's just really, really doing well with her hand contact over the ball. So she can make it go short, she can go deep in the seam, she can go line. She's really just unstoppable right now because she's staying high and she's working on her hand contact, and I'm just really proud of her growth so far.